Chinese industry has never been shy about copying, sometimes illegally, foreign products for local and regional sale. This appears to be the case with the AM General Humvee, the backbone 4x4 vehicle of the United States military services today, as it makes up the framework of the Dongfeng EQ 2050 series trucks, with some cosmetic changes instituted to help differentiate it from its American origins. The Chinese copy and pilot form, prototype, was showcased in 2002 with the vehicle debuting during 2003. Note, various Chinese manufacturers produce Humvee copies. The object of this article is the form produced by Dongfeng. The EQ2050 clearly follows the form and function of the American Humvee. It retains its wide body design and its high ground clearance. The wheels are situated at the extreme corners of the truck for excellent balance and the engine is fitted to the front in the usual way, a large area, slotted hood shrouding it. The front of the vehicle has a grille as well as large recessed headlamps. The forward windscreen consists of two vertical panels with a single supporting frame strut set between them. There are four automobile-style hinged doors for the passengers, two set to either side of the body. The rear section of the truck can be arranged as a flatbed, covered or uncovered, or to fulfill some other needed battlefield function. Drive power is from a license-built Cummins, Dongfeng, EQB 15-20 series turbocharged diesel-fueled engine. This is mated to a 5-speed transmission system. The vehicle is suspended across all four of its wheels for excellent cross-country travel and all tires are tied into an adjustable inflation system. A 6x6 wheel form is also noted. Following its good showing in the Gulf War of 1991, the original Humvee vehicle was showcased to interested Chinese authorities though ultimately not selected for mass procurement. Instead, local industry was tapped to produce a copy, these obtained through civilian market measures for use in the Chinese oil industry, the articles in question being Humvee H1 models. The Chinese army received a batch of nearly 60 trucks for active evaluation in this span of period ranging from 2004 until 2006. The EQ2050, as the EQ2058 Mengsher, was then selected for service soon after and issued in limited numbers to special operations forces and special police detachments. Other notable marks of the EQ2050 lineup include the EQ2025 6x6 model, the CSK141 military form, debuted in 2015, and the military-minded CSK002, described as an airborne assault vehicle. A civilian market model is available with a gasoline-fueled engine and is produced under the DFM brand label of China. Another civilian market model is the EQ2040H Brave Soldier.